Hey guys, so in this video, I'm gonna talk about camera. Specifically, EOS M3. It's a mirrorless unit, mirrorless system. It's pretty good. There is a few plus and a few minus. The plus side for me is the LCD. You can tilt 180 degrees, which is great. And on top of that, you have an audio input, which is on the side here. And it, it's not going to get in the way of your, your lens. And the third one, interchangeable lens, which plays a huge role. It opens up doors to a lot of different angle, a different perspective, a different lens, which is awesome. Now the downside, the downside for this is that it does shoot 1080p, but 1080p you only get 30 frames per second. Now if you want to push it to 60 frames per second, that will cut the quality down to 720p. Now that's still HD, but it's not full HD. Camera nowadays, even though it shoots 4K, it's still maximum do about 60 frames per second. It doesn't do 100, 120 frames per second. My phone here, it does 120 frames per second. It's an iPhone 6S quality is still not too bad. Now bear in mind, this mirrorless system, it does come with a 1.6 crop factor. Every lens that you get, even though it says 22mm right here, it means on a full frame, it's gotta be 22mm. If you're using on a mirrorless system like this one, you have to work out the crop factor for this is 1.6. So which means 22mm, I always need to times 1.6 to get exactly the focal length that I wanted. 22mm is actually translate to 35 mm roughly around there now this one here 18 to 255 which is a kit lens it also translates to about 35 mm to about 85 mm bonus for this is that if you're using a te telephoto lens it does allow you to zoom a lot further in which is great but then if you're trying to shoot landscape like wide angle it's not gonna happen you you are you are not going to get that huge of that wide angle feel and that wide angle look that's all i have to say for, for today if there's any suggestion that you would like to see or it Anything that I've missed, please comment down below. If you think, please comment down below. If you have any suggestion how I can improve, please do so by commenting down, down below. Now bear in mind, this whole video, I'm actually shooting with a GoPro Hero free. It doesn't translate straight, straight to my quality, my video quality. And like I said before, this is my only camera that I use on a daily. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys next video. Thing.